Okay, so don't know how well you can see my stove front, but it's got lots of kid marks, finger marks, and all sorts of, uh, I don't even know what this is. Okay, but it's gross. All right, so I'm gonna get my spurry sponge and my cleaning paste again, and just wipe it off. Scratch proof again. All right, so it's really good on surfaces like this. I don't know how well you can see, but it's just coming off pretty easily. It was all marks that have been there for a long time. Alright. I'm just going to wipe that off. Alright, it's mostly gone. Not sure how well you can see that. Now, I just want to show you with the window cloth and your spray bottle just how nicely these come up. Alright, so you just give it a light mist. And with the dry window cloth, just wipe it and get all these finger marks off. It's really good on stainless steel. With stainless steel, it's best to go with the grain. You get better results that way. And my cloth is getting a bit away from me, but folded. All right, there's on the inside of my stove oven, it's run down and I can't get in there to clean it off. But anyway, you can see the difference. And if you just move to this side, you can see my dishwasher stainless steel again. So I'll just show you how quick and easy it is to clean off the stainless steel. And all the finger marks and you know, you're in the kitchen, so you get all sorts of stuff fall down. Water, stains, and my kids in their dirty hands. But you can see how nice that comes up. All right, and that's your window cloth and water, and it just sparkles.